Former United States Senator and Chattanooga Mayor Bob Corker spoke at today's Pachyderm Club meeting. Corker said this was his first time speaking to a political group in two and a half years. He addressed the U United States' relationship with China as a global power and what can be done about political division here at home. News 12's Chris Gewen spoke with Corker at today's meeting. He joins us now live with what he learned. Chris. Well, Emily, today's meeting lasted about an hour and a half, and Bob Corker was speaking for most of that time, so a lot of topics got covered. But some of the comments that stood out had to do with political rhetoric. Bob Corker said that he was in opposition to antagonism and chest beating when it comes to competing with China on the world stage, and he expressed a similar opinion when it comes to political division here at home. This week's meeting of the Hamilton County Pachyderm Club featured a special guest, former United States Senator and Chattanooga Mayor Bob Corker. Corker spoke on numerous topics, including political rhetoric pertaining to China, which he feels is inappropriately heated and antagonistic. And I think the, a lot of times the chest beating and the pounding and I'm the toughest person in the world and all of that is really because there's a lack of things to say about what we're doing to make our country uh, even stronger. Corker's opposition to antagonistic rhetoric applies to domestic affairs as well. In describing the cause of America's political division, Corker alluded to beliefs held by both parties which aren't founded in reality. Just the things that people believe to be true, Mark. My gosh, are you kidding me? Really? And, and, and where this comes from, I, who, who could possibly believe some of the things that people believe are taking place on both sides of the aisle. Corker was critical of members of Congress who engage in political absolutism, unwilling to reach across the aisle to achieve their goals. You're not strong. You're never going to burn one ounce of capital residing way over if you're a Republican in the right ditch or way over as a Democrat on the left ditch. You're never going to burn an ounce of capital, right? You're never going to have a primary opponent, ever. It's those people that are willing to reach across the aisle and burn political capital and come back home to Hamilton County or wherever they live and explain why they did what they did to people. In my opinion, those are the people that have courage in this country. During his talk, Corker was also asked to address the issue of human trafficking. Corker said that he was disappointed with legislative efforts to combat the trafficking, and he underscored that it is a worldwide issue. Live outside of the feed company on Main Street, Chris Gewen, News 12 Now.